Incidence rate ratio abbreviated as IRR is a common effect size that is used when performing Poisson regression or count regression. Poisson regression is a type of a regression uh, where the outcome is uh, in a form of a count or discrete variable and the predictors can be continuous, nominal or ordinal and the objective of performing Poisson regression is to fit the data and generate a model and to find out whether the predictors can predict the outcome and the effect size that is used when performing Poisson regression or calculated is the incidence rate ratio IRR. If you find this video useful, do subscribe to the channel, leave any comment in the indicated uh, box and activate the notification bell to receive the recent and uh, latest release uh, into the channel of several different video clip and click on the like icon and share the video link with others so the channel can expand and improve to include a large scope of different statistical method and how to analyze data using uh, several different uh, statistical packages such as SPSS, Excel, Stata, Jamovi, R Statistic, or Statistics, Graph, Pad, Prism, G Power, Python, and RevMan. So the Incident rate is defined as the rate of new cases observed in population over some period of time. And the formula for calculating the incidence rate is IR equal to the number of new cases within time period. So we need to calculate and count the number of new cases in a defined period or time period divided by the number of people at the risk for the disease. So that drives us to define the incidence rate ratio which is the IRR which is the ratio of two different rates of incidence so both have the same period of time and sometimes it's called incidence density ratio relative risk and they are represented in the uh, regression or Poisson regression output as an exponential coefficient the formula for calculating the IRR is the incidence rate 1 divided by the incidence rate 2 to uh, calculate the final IRR. So what does the value of IRR mean? If the value is 1 then there is no effect of predictor on the outcome. If the IRR greater than 1 then there is a positive relationship and the predictor is associated with a higher mean of an outcome. So with an increase uh, mean of an outcome, then there is a, a positive relationship between the outcome and the predictor. If the uh, value for the IRR is less than 1, then there is a negative relationship between the predictor and the outcome, and the predictor is associated with lower mean of outcome. So this is the way to um, extrapolate and uh, interpret the outcome from Poisson regression using the IRR values as a representative of the effect size. 
if you are a student or a researcher and you have a data whether it is um, um, quantitative all qualitative and you want to perform a statistical uh, analysis on that data using any of the softwares listed here whether it's SPSS, Excel, Stata, Jamovi, R Statistics, Graphpad, Prism, Revman, GMP, Python then do contact me to arrange for either a one-to-one -one private tutor session or a training course uh, on any of these uh, statistical packages my contact details are given here so don't hesitate to uh, write to me or email me if you need uh, a private one-to-one uh, -one, uh, tutoring or a training course